I should put the whole sign right in front of my puss. Well, there's other people in the cast besides ourselves. I should put it in front of your face. Well, what is the difference? What, are you a high-class guy or something? I mean, don't, don't put it in front of my face. I want to look at all the people out here. All right, they see enough of your face. <laughs> well, there's wrong with me. Well, let's get started with the show. Let's do some funny stuff. What funny stuff? You know, let's tell something. Well, we don't uh, we don't tell jokes. We, in fact, we have no jokes. We tell ru uh, ru routine minute, sort of uh, stories. And... We have no jokes. No, that's right. You're I was, right. I was telling you. But I have a joke. You, ha you have a what? I have a joke. Where'd you get it? I tell a joke. Where'd you get the joke? I wrote it myself. You wrote a joke? Brand new one. Wrote it yourself? Nobody's ever heard it before. Is it funny? It's clean. Yeah, I don't mean that. Is it funny? <laughs> I think so. And it's brand new? Yes. You think the folks out there will like it? I think so. It's a, it's, it's a fish story. How long will it take to tell it? A couple of seconds. The only thing is, you ain't got nothing to say in it. You might as well get a chair and sit down because you don't open your mouth once through the whole thing. But it's funny. Very cute. And you wrote it. Yeah, but you keep your mouth shut. You don't get... You no. got nothing to say what's no, I don't have to say anything as long as you wrote it. It's about a whale, a ship, and Jonah. And it's funny. Yeah. And you wrote it. Yeah, now don't talk right. no more. Well, go ahead. Let's hear it. Let's now see Now don't say another word. No. As okay. long as it's funny. It's funny! And it's brand new. Now keep your mouth shut. Go ahead. Let's hear it. Once upon a time, there was a whale. What kind of a whale? <laughs> okay, well. You see, that's what I mean. You got to keep your mouth shut. You ain't got oh. nothing to say in this. Well, all right, no, it's not a problem. You don't have to ask me what kind of whale it is because I don't know what kind of whale it was. All right, let's forget about it. How do I know what kind of whale it is? Don't shout now. What do you think I do? Belong to whale gang or something? I know the whale's higher whale. Well, all right. I asked you to keep your mouth shut tonight. Go ahead. Well, keep it shut. Now, this whale was in the ocean. What ocean? This so. What ocean? I think the folks would like to know where this took place, don't you think? Go ahead, pick out an ocean, what I care. That's immaterial to me. All right, immaterial ocean. Oh, what kind of ocean? Now, the whale was in the immaterial ocean. It was minus own business, but it was following a ship. What ship? This ship. What ship? <laughs> what ship? I told you, you don't say nothing in the story. I do the whole story by myself. You're telling it, but I just... But you keep opening your mouth. Now, keep a shot. I only ask you, what kind of a ship? A ship, a plain everyday ship that swims in the water. You mean a swim ship? Yeah. <laughs> now, the whale was following a swim ship because... Who ever heard of a swim ship? I don't know, Lou. That's your Will you story. Please, keep your mouth shut, will you please? All right, go ahead. You're getting me aggravated now. Take it easy, take it easy. Go ahead. Now, the ship was following the whale... What? Because... Now I got the ship following the, the whale. whale was following the ship. <laughs> the whale was following the ship yeah. because the whale was hungry. Naturally. Now, Captain Jonah was the captain of the boat, and he didn't want the whale to capsize the boat. Do I? He didn't want the whale to capsize the boat. Capsize. So he, he didn't want the whale to capsize the boat. Capsize. So he... he, he because you know what capsize means. I don't put in big words like that if I don't know what it means. Plus, I don't know what it means. He didn't want the whale what to capsize. What does it mean? Capsize. Capsize. That's a big word. Well, what does it mean? Good one. Well, what does it mean? Capsize. Capsize. Story should have been over. Well, what does it mean? Get it over with. Capsize. Capsize. Right. Seven and a quarter. Six All seven right. Eight. Eight. All right. So he didn't want the whale of six or seven eighths the boat. Yeah. So what did he, he Captain Jonah was a brave man, so he threw the, he threw the whale over a barrel of apples. What kind of apples? And, and just as soon as he, he, he... What kind of apples? I guess you're not tend to rock me. Well, what kind of apples? What, what's so harmful about that? Plain, I... everyday apples. Well, apples there's... that grow on a tree. Well, there's all kinds of apples, Lou. There's Baldwin apples, there's frost apples. And... Crab apples! Well, tell the people. He's got me mad at you, oh, folks. Take it easy, wow. take it easy, take it easy. Come on now, get it over with. So the whale ate the, ate the apples. Now, Captain Jonah realized that the whale was still going to capsize the boat. Don't ask me again about that thing. All right. So when, he, when the whale ate the apples, he was still hungry. So then Captain Jonah threw him over a stool. What kind of stool? Who said that? Me, in case you asked. Oh, a yes. three-legged camp stool. So the whale ate the stool. Now, the whale ate the apples and the whale ate the stool, and the whale was still hungry. In other words, his appetite had not been appeased. Mm -hmm. And that's a pretty good word, too. All right, too. Well, go ahead. Let's hear the finish of this. So Captain Jonah, being a very brave man, he didn't want the whale to capsize the boat, and he wanted to save all the passengers mm -hmm. on the boat. So what did he do? I don't know. I'm going to tell you what he Just did. Keep quiet. Go ahead. He sacrificed himself. Yeah. He threw a beautiful jackknife dive right off the boat into the mouth of the whale. Mm -hmm. Now, the whale opened up his mouth and he swallowed Captain Jonah. He swallowed the apples and he uh, swallowed the stool. And then the whale swam wait, away. Wait a minute, Lou. Three years later, uh, they caught that very Lock same Lou. whale down here in the just, bay. Just a minute. And they cut him open. Wait, wait a minute, Lou. And what do you think they found? Wait a minute, just one minute. One more interruption. Now, he says something here, then I tell wait you the funny answer. One more interruption. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Lou, you're not coming out here in front of this intelligent audience. Millions and millions of people listening and watching. 
You're not coming out and trying to get away with that old wheeze, that old pun about the time they, they caught the whale and they cut him open and there they found Jonah seated on that stool selling those apples three for a nickel, are you? That's not the story you intended to come out here and open up the show with. Now, wait a minute. Folks, I'm really sorry. I want to apologize. It couldn't be that story. Because every little schoolboy knows that story. That's right. And he said it was brand new. No one had ever heard about it. And... But I'm sorry. I apologize. Now, you go ahead and tell the folks what they found when they cut the wheel open. I say, tell the folks what they found when they cut the wheel open. You, you do know the answer, don't you? Hmm? Feel good? You know, I, I, I thought it was a build-up to that old wheeze, but it couldn't be that because every little schoolboy knows that joke. <laughs> Got the wheel open there, they found Joe the seat on the stool. I, Lou, 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 come here a minute now. We're not finished. I want you to tell the folks. 